Hey guys, welcome to a new video from me and in this video you are going to see how we actually got 7600 trophies which is actually the second highest league in Clash Royale. If you guys don't feel free to press like button and for sure also to subscribe to the channel and I apologize guys, I un had unfortunately some lag so I cut them out but I think the video will be still pretty cool, have fun. Let's see, let's see how many games are left more playing against Aegis. And I'm feeling completely ready. Let's see what Aegis is actually playing. And otherwise, I'm just gonna wait for sure. Don't have actually any kind of time pressure. So just waiting until Aegis is something doing. Or I'm just going in with a tombstone at, at around about minute two. Okay, okay, okay. Let me wait. We could also go in with Mega Minion, but I don't want to. But also if it's... Electro Giant Tombstone first play wouldn't be cool and I would say just go in with the Tombstone uh, with the Mega Minion. Sorry guys. I'm thinking about it could be something with Beatdown Yeah, it could be still E Giant If it's really E Giant My mind would be so broken. Holy shit. Oh Whoa, whoa, card legend. I thought about already about E Giant because actually E Giant is the only deck which is really waiting and great, great by us that we waited with the tombstone. And now we can defend that hopefully pretty pretty well. Just going in with the guards like that. Ah shit. Huh. Didn't defend it that great, but luckily there's still a lot of damage onto the King Tower. <sighs> okay, I'm thinking about doing actually the lava hound at the bridge at the right lane because we having the king tower already nearly down but not really sure if it's the right play but it's looking like he is just having the baby dragon against us and then for sure it's the right play dragons behind the lava hound for sure as well just to make or just to keep the pressure real and then it's lightning value yes it's lightning value but also you guys can see that the lava hound is shipping and now it's the first time to fireball that maybe also predicting something yes we also predicted something pub is on the tower zap is dealing 77 and we won the next game that's actually so so great and yeah that's exactly what we are needing actually that's exactly what we are needing and I would say let's instantly jump into the next uh, game. Let's see what's coming next from him. Okay, okay, okay. I don't. I hope I'm not having any kind of lags. Actually, it's looking like my program is saying I'm having lags, but I can't see any kind of lags. So it's fine. Just hoping we don't have any lags. But to be honest, my PC is so trash, and I'm also gonna buy a new. A new one this year okay but as till uh, till there we have to keep our old pc for sure and for sure i hope also that the pc is not uh, doing bad stuff today okay 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 okay, okay. kaniki kaniki is again higher than we are so it's looking like we are getting so much trophies going in with the guards because i want to make actually something first play and now it's just time actually to wait Skeleton Dragons are going in and we're playing against Lockbait. Lockbait is a hard matchup. Lockbait is a hard matchup, but when you're playing good, it's winnable. So, having Mega Minion actually ready against him. Great Skeletons by us. It's no Shane. And I thought about when it's really a shame, we could actually activate the King Tower. Now he's going in with the barrel actually. Not really sure if the barrel was good by him. But it's fine, it's his decision. The barrel was actually not that bad to be honest. But now going in with the Mega Minion. And feeling ready to fireball the next Princess. And now going in with the next Drake. So holy crap! Great Mega Minion is doing insane stuff. Is pulling somehow else, somewhere else. It's great. Yes, his rocket is good as well. But the Electro Spirit for sure isn't doing great stuff. Because even if the Electro Spirit is killing your pups. The pups are still needing two hits by the tower. So maybe he could go in now with the Tesla or something like that. But what a, what a great start for sure. We could go in for Zap. But Zap wouldn't be... Uh, great by us. So now I think it's just time for the next tombstone in the back and Let's see what's coming next tombstone is going in the back 
And we could go in with the Lava Hound at the bridge because Tesla is out of the cycle. So we will get a lot of free ship damage also. Guards are just going in, killing everything, I guess. And even if he's going in with Lock, it would be great for us. He, yeah, he, could, he could have the Tesla back with the Electro Spirit. So just going in with the Dragons to predict actually his Tesla. What a great play by us also we could just uh, zap that so hopefully the tesla is going down and hopefully the dragons are going to ship down the tower otherwise i'm just going with the lava hound and with the next mega minion for sure mega minion is great against his okay balloon is going in guts is going in as well and now we actually could tombstone that and we just could Fireball that, yeah, just going in with the fireball, just going in with the mega minion, and that's it actually for the next game. Great, great, great for us, but also great for us that he played with the Tesla. Otherwise, it would be a pretty, pretty hard matchup to be honest, because against the new buffed Inferno Tower, it gets even more harder. And now we needing just 21 more trophies, and to be honest, 21 trophies in this trophy range is actually free. Or not free, I mean, it's guaranteed. You're always getting 21 or more. Actually, I'm not really sure, don't want to say something wrong, correct me if I'm wrong. But I think normally you're always getting something between 35 and 25. I think it's not normal to get extreme numbers, for example, 44 plus or something like that. But please, please correct me if I'm wrong, I'm not having that much experience. I'm going in now with the tombstone tombstone was great by us also defending the dark prince in the back and the bandit so now it's just time actually for the lava hound at the right not sure if his um barbarian barrel was great by him but it's okay dealing with that for sure mega minion is going in luckily the skeletons are walking onto us he's going in with the zap and now i'm just going in with the balloon actually like that and let's see how what his answers are gonna be. So going in now with the zap actually. Hopefully um, his electro wizard won't kill actually everything. But that's exactly what the electro wizard did with us. So guards are going in. We could play the guards a little bit higher, but it's not necessary. Also the queen is just dealing one or two hits. Okay, just is yeah for sure. It's a lot of damage. So tombstone is going in. Hopefully the tombstone will be a flawless defense against bandit. Hopefully they are coming two more skeletons off. Yes, that's a perfect tombstone actually. So always keep your tombstone in the hand. So actually you're defending the bandit for a free to free trade, and you also can't go in same lane for the next seconds. So great tombstone by us. And now just going in with the mega minion actually. So defending actually the Dark Prince also, we could go in with the Zap, but we don't have to go in with the Zap because I think we will keep our tower and now we keeping our right tower and our left tower. For sure, both towers got a lot of damage, but we keeping our both towers. Uh, we could go in with the Zap at the left lane. Guards are going in. Dragons are going in. Next Lava Hound is going in. And the next Lava Hound is tanking actually for everything. Also, he still needs to take two towers down. Think there's coming a Dark Prince at the left side. Tombstone is just going in. So I'm hopefully defending the Dark Prince flawlessly. Guards are just going in as well against the Electro Wizard. Skelly Drags are going in as well. And now it's just time for a Zap actually. It's just time for Zap. Great Zap by us. Hopefully the Tombstone is going to survive. Mega Minion is going in. Next Tombstone will come right now. And yeah, we are defending Zareldo. We are defending his deck luckily. Guards are also just going in. And what a great push. Luckily we didn't got even one lose. I'm not sure yet if I'm having some lags. If I had some lags in this video. I'm sorry guys. Um don't know how to change it but anyways we got 7600 trophies in this video it's a great run until here and yeah if you don't want to miss actually the last video where we're getting 8000 trophies feel free to subscribe to the channel and see you next video bye